Sub guys, how are you doing? I hope you are doing good. So welcome back again to a new video. So this video is gonna be very interesting and super easy. What I'm going to teach you is how to change your primary email or how to add primary email to a Facebook account. That's gonna be really really super easy. So follow each and every step. Okay, the first thing is you need to open a browser. In my case, I will be using Go Login, which is a great edited browser for work. And also, I will be showing you a Showing, showing you one of the coolest option of go login okay first of all let's move to our profile so here i have created a profile called as test i will click on run so here i will just search facebook.com and here if i go to the settings And if I click here, then we have to click on personal details. So here you can see there are two emails and we can't see which one is primary email, right? So what I will do, I will just show you how you can just change your primary email. But before that, let me show you one of the coolest option of Go login. If see what happens if I close this browser directly. So it will take some time to stop. And then if you come again, come up again to the same profile, you will see you will be still there where you left. Okay, so this is one of the very coolest option that I like, like whenever I stop my work or I accidentally close a browser. So I never like to lose my work. I always come back and see where I left, right? So if I click on view again, if I click on run again, You can see I'm still there, right? So here I can't see which one is my primary email. So let's search M basic FP. Then click enter. Here, just click on the first option. Just don't do anything. Just click on this option settings and privacy. And here click on personal account information, right? Click edit. So suppose this is the email, this is the primary email, but you need to change it and uh, make another email as an as a primary email. Okay. Suppose I'm opening temp mail just for an example to show you. Sometimes you are not able to do that. You are you are not able to make changes. That is just because you have just logged in your account. So just you have to surf your browser or the account for uh, minimum seven to fifteen days. Then you will be able to make your email as a primary email. So suppose here I'm gonna add my email then click on add email okay so you can see you can't make changes at the moment so I will have to use this account for a while but this is how you can check what is your primary email and you can make a changes so suppose this is my primary email okay and uh, when will when you will add the another email you will be able to click over here here you can you, you you will be able to click and then you can just choose what will be your primary email like this either either this or either this okay you can choose uh, between both of them okay so that's gonna be really easy and this is how you can see your primary email right so today i just showed you two things first one is how you can see your primary email of how you can change it Okay, just within a gap of uh, 10 to 15 days, you will be able to add your another primary email and then you can switch to that second email. Like here you will be able to click when you will confirm your email, then you can choose if you want to keep it as a primary email or if you want to change it, right? And another thing I told you that the cloud option. So this is how it works and you should give it a shot. So that's all about how you can check your primary email. I hope you liked the video and uh, do let me know in the comment section. And if you want to download it, I will just put the link in the description. See you in the next video. Thank you.